Hey guys, what is up? Flyerswimming93 here. Uh, today I'm going to be uh, looking over my uh, Flyers cards that I have. Um, I have a really big binder of cards. Um, the binder is pretty big. I mean, it's not, as you can see, it's not filled all the way, but it has a decent amount in there. It has maybe like 20 some pages um, that I've counted. Um, the binder, it has two pockets, like on the left side. It has like a smaller pocket and then a bigger pocket and in those. Before I get to the cards, I'm going to show you what I have in those. So, as you've seen in uh, some other videos, uh, it will actually in another memorabilia video, I have the uh, three pocket schedules, the Phantoms, and the two Flyers, ones from the 90s. So I have those in there. Uh, I have an autographed Brian Prop picture. I have this picture from a Flyers game that my dad took. Uh, a couple years ago when they uh, won, I was from a shootout and it was just like them like high five and after the win, it was a pretty nice picture. This I got from the draft. It's a Dave Schultz uh, large upper deck. Uh, it, 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 I mean, it looks like a card, but it, it, I got an autograph by Dave Schultz. That's really cool. Um, this is a picture of me, my dad, and Eric Desjardins a couple years ago. Uh, this is a life, it's like a bigger size. I actually have two, or I, I have two or three of the smaller version, and then I have a bigger version, but it's an upper deck John LeClaire card. That's the front, that's what it looks like, and then that's the back. It's an upper deck UD Choice. It's one of the older ones. It's pretty nice. I have, a, I, ha, I actually just recently got uh, two of them a couple uh, days ago when I got opened a big pack uh, so I have a the you've seen these before too the Danny Briere game card teaming in and then I have the Gagne one so I have actually in here I have two teaming in uh, I think I have two of each but the other ones are packed away so I have these in here as well and uh, this is actually from my first ever hockey game. It's um, the AHL Winter Classic Phantoms. They play the Hershey Bears at Citizens Bank Park. Uh, Phantoms won 4-3 in overtime. Uh, so I have a couple, I'm not a couple, I actually have the game card and then on the back it has the stats and who was on the team at the time. So a couple, couple flyers uh, that are still on the team. Um, trying to see Brandon Manning is on here. Uh, so most players like were traded. Um, let me see who was, who was traded. Holmstrom, I think. Bartulis was on the 2010 team. Uh, and that's not really that important. And then the goalies, it's just Michael Layton. Um, yeah, that's really it. So, I mean, it, it wasn't like that big of a team. Like there wasn't many players on it, but it was still a cool game. They ended up winning too. They came back, and then. Uh, they were losing. Hershey scored real early in the first period, maybe like a couple seconds in. And then um, Phantoms, they were losing 3-2. They tied it, and then they won in overtime early. And then the other thing I have in this folder is a signed Bernie Prom picture. So that's pretty cool. But most, most of them, the things in here are maybe life size. Honestly, I think the coolest thing in here is probably... The Phantoms thing because it's for my first hockey game, and then the Bernie Perron picture is nice, and the three game cards from the team in Rare and Gagne. So that was pretty cool. Okay, so now we're gonna get to the cards. So I have, I'd say, I say maybe like 20 something pages in here. Um, a lot of these cards, um, I don't really like. I mean, I, 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 I've been collecting cards for a couple months now, I haven't been doing it. I haven't done it for a while. I just had these and I never really used them and then I started to get more. So uh, one of the, one of the, this actually isn't a Flyers card. This is the only non-Flyers card that's in here. And it is from the first NHL All-Star game. So that's the front side. If I can grab it. And that's the back. Um, it's all of the young, all of the old players. Uh, there's a couple. There's a couple Bruins players. New, what's his name? 
New York Americans, Canadians, Fighters, Rangers, Bruins. Uh, yeah, that's really it. There isn't many on here. That is actually the only non-Flyers card that's in here. The first page, it's like the older players. So I have a couple. Um, I have Bobby Clark. Mm, I have a couple Bobby Clarks. I have a couple Paul Holmgren's on here. Um, a Bo Barber and then Mark Howe and Doug Crossman. And then on this this one is actually when it's from the Patrick Division. And it's a team picture from when we won the Stanley Cup. I'm not sure what year. I might probably either 74, obviously either 74 or 75. It's probably 75 because the car was made in 76. So I'm going to say it was a 75 one. But that's probably one of my good best cards. Um, okay, so the next page is actually I have is a goalie page. Uh, there's a lot of Hextall in here. I have a couple um, good ones. Uh, most of them are Hextall. Um, let me show you a couple of these ones. This is a really nice Bob Taylor one. I got that a couple years ago. Uh, so most of these are Hextall, as I said. But uh, I have a couple ones that aren't. It's two Dominic Roussel, a Pete Peters, and a Ken Reggett, and then the other ones. Then I have four Hextall, and then the Bob Taylor. So that makes up the, the whole nine. Uh, the next page is all um, of the Legion of Doom line, Lindros, Leclair, excuse me, and uh, Renberg. And so this whole page, i actually show you the whole page. This is actually the page, if you can see, I'm not sure, yeah, there we go. So that is the whole page, front row, middle, and then the third. So we got the whole page in here. Some of these from Lindros are when he was on the Ottawa Generals. Uh, actually, there's two of them. Uh, then the next page is not, is actually like the older players. There's a couple Lindros, Keith Primo, Desjardins, Van Beesbrook, Racky, uh, Agagne, Aronik, and then that life side, and then that, the one with the life side, but the bigger Leclerc, that's the mini one too. So I have the big one and the smaller one as well that go with it now. With the cards that I do have, um, most of them I have are in, I try to put them in um, whatever uh, company they are, whatever whatever like brand, their tops, upper deck, OPG, something like that. I put them in order, or at least I try to. Let me show these, sorry, I'm just trying to see if the pages are clipped, but anyway. Um, as I was saying, I have this whole page is tops. So I have a tops page. I have a whole tops, two full of PG pages. Then I have three score 91, which were like the red and blue. If they had like the red on the outside or, or the blue, they look like this. Now let me show you a blue one just to give you an idea. This is the Dan Quinn. Score 91. That's what, that, that's what they look like. They were either red or blue, and they had different ones. Uh, I have three pages of them. Those are nice. Um, and then I have, kind of goes to like a newer one. I have an Upper Deck MVP set. A whole nine page one. Uh, it's all of the like, kind of older players. Not newer, but uh, it's... It came with Carter, Richards, Gagne, Hartnell, Pronger, Giroux, Briere, Carcello, and Coburn. And that, that was the whole one. And they're all like, they all have a silver autograph. Like, and it, it, it's not like a real autograph, but it's still, uh, you know, it's, it's on the card. Most of them are the black jerseys. Uh, one, the Pronger one, he's actually in his Anaheim jersey. And then the Carter. And the Richards are two of the other ones, so I'll show you these. I'm trying to get the glare off of them as much as possible. But that's what they look like. And uh, honestly, the only um, autograph that actually looks you're able to read is Giroux. And I don't even think he actually autographed it. I think they just put like Claude Giroux in cursive. Because it doesn't look like an autograph. It just looks like someone wrote it in cursive, so I'm not sure. But... Because 
I've seen Daru's autograph on like pictures and that's not what it looks like. But uh, anyway, that's an upper deck set and then the next page is upper deck. I have the next page as upper deck. The next one's upper deck as well. Uh, these, this page is also upper yeah, yeah, this one's upper deck too. And then these are actually all newer cards that I just got. So these are um, ones that I got this summer. Uh, I have a couple, most of these are score. So most of the brands are score. This whole page is score right here. Then I have a whole set of this, these score ones by Panini. Uh, it's from the 13-14 season that's all uh, the players it's Drew, Reed, Simmons, Brzgalov, Mazaros, Fedotango, Luke Shen, Kutz, and Grossman and then I have a couple of those so I got a whole page there that of, of them of the score ones now I have this one page I haven't I've been trying to whatever other cards that I have I've been trying to just keep them together so this this page I kind of just threw together it's a couple good cards I have I have a score team leaders uh, one. It has Giroux, Voracek, Brzgalov, and Ronaldo. So that's that's a nice card. It's got all four of them here. And then it has the stats on the back as well. Uh, I have a Zach Ronaldo hot rookies card. I also have two more of these. It is... Um, see who the other one is. The other ones are of the hot rookies, so I have three of them. It is Eric Gustafson, Ben Holmstrom, and the Ronaldo, so I have three of them. And then on the other page that I was looking at, I have uh, two Upper Deck Parkers. It's a Voracek and a Couturier, and then I have two scores. They're Jerome Briere. I have Upper Deck Collector's Choice, Lindros, a Briere. Uh, LPG Richards, the Briere is Panini, and yeah, that's it. That's about the whole page there. It looks like I'm trying to get the glare off as much as possible. I'm sorry about that. It's kind of hard when you have the plastic over the cards. So, going back to the older cards, I have. A couple pro sets and three score, or uh, actually, I have five pro sets and um, four score on here. Um, so the pro sets, they are. It's just NHL pro set. It doesn't. That's what it is. So it's not like a uh, upper deck or anything. So it has. I have a couple. I have five. I don't have many, but this is a Pelly Eklund one. Looks like this. That's what the NHL Pro set is. It's the old NHL logo. It has the Pelly Lacken on it. And then those are the stats as well. Um, so I mean, I've been I'm trying to get some more of the the NHL the old NHL Pro sets and definitely some more score because I don't have that many of the newer. I mean, I have a newer score, but I don't have like the uh, late '90s score. I have score '91. And the other ones, which were all the players from the 80s and stuff. So, now, the next couple pages. I have these th these three pages. I'm trying to get the whole 2010 Stanley Cup Final team that lost to Chicago in six. I have most of them. I need, I need maybe about five or six more players. I have... Richards, Van Riemsdyk, Carter, Carcillo, Layton, Coburn, Giroux, Lano, Cardinal, Briere, Pronger, Boucher, Timonen, Carl, Carcillo. Do I have two Carcillos? Oh, no, I have uh, No, sorry, I must... Oh, yeah, I do have two Carcillos, actually. So I have two score... Okay. And then I have a Blair Butts, Andreas Noodle, and Jody Shelley. And then on the next page... I have Eric Gustafson, Ben Holmstrom, James Duchini, and another Van Riemsdyk. This Van Riemsdyk is actually different. This one I like more because it's a Stanley Cup playoff playoff highlight one from the 2011 series against Buffalo, and it says on the back uh, what, what happened, and it has his stats from the playoffs. Uh, 11 game, 11 games played, 
seven goals. He didn't have any assists. He just had seven goals that year in the playoffs. Ben Rings like so. Hopefully, he can do that again this year. If we uh, make the playoffs again, which I'm thinking we probably will. So, but uh, yeah, and I thought that was kind of cool when I actually when I lo opened the box, the pack that I got the other day with uh, the cards. I had looked through it and I was trying to get the 20th in team. I had maybe four cards and it was like a Briere, a Richards, Giroux, and I think um, I think it was actually two Briere's or it was the other Parcello, I'm not sure. But I was looking through it and I'm looking, I was talking to my dad and I'm looking through it and I had like the whole 2010 team in that one pack. There was maybe like, how many cards are here of the red? There's six and nine, that's 15. There's 15 cards here that were all from the 2010 team. And then I had three more, which were newer scores. It was the Blair Betts, the Noodle, and the Sh and the Jody Shelley. So that makes up to be 18 of all of all of them, and then the four on the next page. So I have like 22. I'm kind of I'm close because they had a couple other players, but I don't know if they make cards of them. So I'm kind of very close to getting the whole 2010 team. And then this next page I have is going to be, I'm going to try to get newer goalies. As I said, I have the older, older goalies page. It's got a Steve Mason, Neuwirth, Berzgalov, Bobrovsky, J Jeremy Dushini. I really don't know how to say that guy's name. Jeremy Dushini, I think. I'm not sure. And then I have another Steve Mason. But I have, but the, the Masons are different brands, so it helps. So that's that goalie page, and then there's the bottom as well. So I only have six cards on that page. And then... The last page I have is a, I'm trying to get a whole brothers page, and I, I have, I have to off the page, but I have uh, three of the same Parkhurst Upper Deck Braden Shen Winter Classics. I have three of them. So they're all the same card, and then I have a score of Luke Shen. So I'm trying to get the Sutter Brothers, and I have to see, and the, like, the Watson Brothers, I have to see if there's more brothers. That I'm able to get and throw them on the, either that page or get another page. And then at the end of the binder, there's two empty pages for more cards. Now, the one card that I've been wanting to show you for a while is, I, if you follow me on Instagram, you would have saw it. Pulled this out of a pack the other day. It's an Ivan Provorov Parkhurst Upper Deck rookie card. So I, it's not in the binder because it's pretty valuable. Um, well, to me, I don't, not money-wise, but to me it is. Uh, that's the front and then the back and just to even prove it's a rookie card it doesn't have focus it right, won't focus but it doesn't have his uh, NHL stats on here it just has his brand new week king stats and yeah so that's that's all the hockey cards that I have uh, that are Flyers cards so I'm gonna try to uh, this year, if I go to the carnival, I want to try to get some of these autographed if I'm able to. Um, I had a great time doing this video. That was awesome. Uh, most of these packs that I got, um, I've had some of those cards for a while. The newer cards, uh, like like this Provorov and those score ones of the 2010 team, I do actually got a couple couple of these ago. Um, I've been trying to look through all the cards and see who I have, and I try to. I try to keep them organized by brand so it's easier to look through them. So, I mean, it, it's a work in progress, but we'll, we'll get there. I'm going to, might have another video um, out at some point. I'm not sure what I'm going to be doing yet. I haven't really had much time since I've been getting back from Boston and everything. And uh, when I was down the shore for a couple of days. So, I'm uh, still trying to think of ideas to um, put together since I'm not really able to do much. Uh, plus, I also have to do a lot of schoolwork for the summer. So, yeah, so that's really it. Um, I had a great time doing this video. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed the new jersey as well. I have the Drew 2012 All-Star jersey. So I figured I'd wear that for this video and also the cards. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'll see you guys in the next one and goodbye.